Okay, I am live. And uh, I guess I don't need my headphones. So I'm not listening to anything. So yeah, I was supposed to interview Aiden tonight. I really wanted to talk to him just to see uh, if he listened to his uncle's episode all the way through and what he thought of it and uh, I've heard about his uncle for a long time so that was a great talk we had today with Mark Lindsay but anyway I'll talk I'll catch up with Aiden he's just uh busy with other more important things so I thought I would take this opportunity to do a really quick video just documenting something strange that happened to me yesterday at work I was driving around it's nothing dramatic it's just silly and frivolous and I wore this sweater today. You may have seen me wear it in the past on previous episodes. But there's a reason why I'm wearing this sweater today. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to take you on a little journey. The same journey I took yesterday in my car. Well, it wasn't a car. It was a truck. Here in Montreal North. Montreal Nord. You can see it there on your screen. This is Google Maps, by the way. Okay. This is Pinuf and Industrial. So this is Industrial. This is Pinuf. I work somewhere over here, but um, I don't know. Can you see? Are you able to see my mouse? You can't really see my mouse. It's washed out. Anyway, it doesn't matter. We'll go to the street view. And I'll show you what I saw yesterday. This Boulevard Pinuf has been under construction for years. I don't know why they're putting a bus pathway in the middle, the center of the road, but that's what they're doing. Pinuf, by the way, is Pius the Ninth, famous for. Uh, hiding, fleeing for his life to Gaeta, Italy, to escape from the persecution of the secular authorities, the government. And he famously proclaimed the dogma of the Immaculate Conception. I hope I got that right, Immaculate Conception, right? And so as I'm driving, there is a stoplight up ahead here you can see. And I'm just sitting here, I'm stopped, and I'm looking at the billboards, and I'm just being very silly. In my mind, I'm looking at the billboard. Whoops, went too far. Let me back up here. Looking at the billboard, okay. Sorry, I'm having a hard time here. I'm looking at the billboard, and I'm just thinking to myself, okay, who's this dude with the guitar here? Who's the dude? Does he know how to play guitar? I'm just thinking all kinds of thoughts. Like, is he holding? If I talk to an expert, would he recognize this dude knows what he's doing with the guitar? Yes or no? Simple question, right? And then I thought, what's this chick here? Whether she a pharmacist or what is she? This one here. So, I was just trying to think. Is she Portuguese? I'm looking at her face and I see Palmucci. That's like Italian. Okay. And I'm like, who's this dude with the man bun next to it? Right? And then I'm like, oh, 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 oh. Uh, that's me, man. <laughs> me. That is me, without a doubt. So I want to just do a little compare and contrast. Zoom in a bit. I'm going to compare and contrast. I'm going to show you. I've got this little camera, security camera set up behind me here. Cropped it. It's like a very wide fisheye angle lens. I bought it to uh, for security purposes, not not for my. Well, I'm not going to go into details explaining it. But I don't know if you can see if, if you can see my uh, sweater, the cuff on my sweater, and the collar of this sweater. And in the photo, I have a backpack on. You can't really see it, but you can see my man bun. I'll do this so you can see it more uh, without the glasses. You can see 
that's the shape of my head. That's the shape of my man bun. You can see everything corresponds. I just thought it was hilarious that this thing has been up there. I drive past this almost every day, not every day, but quite often I, I drive past it. And uh, how many times have I seen this? And I never realized I'm in there <laughs> in that photo. So I looked up the pharmacy. It's the Jean Coutu, right? Uh, not too far from here. So that was a funny little discovery. And uh, I'll go back to the camera so I can talk to you. Yeah, so that, I thought that was hilarious. Like uh, I got my sweater, my characteristic sweater on. And I got my man bun. <laughs> I'm just surprised because in my entire life, I've been there twice, and that was years ago, uh, maybe uh, four or five years ago, three, four or five years ago. Very rarely go to the pharmacy. I can't remember what I was in there for. Nothing major, maybe a pack of gum or some lip gloss. Lips are always dry. And uh, I'm trying to remember if I've ever seen, if in that Jean Coutu, if I noticed at the time that there was a photographer there. I'm trying to remember. I can't remember. My memory is not that hot. But you can see, uh, you can't really see it. It's a bad, on Google Maps, it's a bad, uh, bad image. But um, my sideburns are red there. And now they're all mostly gray, white. Now that they're turning gray, I keep them shorter. I used to have bushy when they were red. So that's it. No philosophical or religious content in this video. I'm just documenting it because I think it's hilarious. And they will eventually take that billboard down. And it's the only one. It's it's the only one because it's uh, it's the over, it's the only overpass where the construction's taking place on Pinot, which is how you say Pius the Ninth in French. P means Pius. Neuf means nine. So Pinoff Boulevard is Boulevard Pius the Ninth, and it's the only place where the construction is indicated with this big uh, thing. So I wanted to document it with this little silly video. I just thought it was hilarious, and uh, it's uh, nothing. Uh, nothing I can really say about it. I guess the religious content is that it's uh, Blessed Pius the Ninth. Blessed Pius the Ninth, pray for us. So that's it. Hope you found that mildly amusing, as I did, and take care of yourselves. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. We'll talk soon. God bless.